So I asked myself one day, how high can the icon jump now that we have the 2.2 update? There's a lot of ways to make the icon jump, but I just want to try and, you know, measure how far it can actually go without getting into the decimals. We'll use integer measurements for now. So let's start with the most basic one, of course, just normally jumping. As you would expect, it can surpass around 3 to 4 blocks, somewhere along that ballpark. Of course, that's quite bad, but we can always do better. So let's place a red pad there. So now we can see that it can surpass around 7 blocks. That's still pretty garbage, but we can always do better. With the introduction of the gravity trigger, things will of course get a lot more interesting, which will therefore affect only player 1 since we don't have player 2 in this experiment. As you can see, it surpassed around 15 blocks. That's still pretty bad, but we can always do better. So now we minimize the gravity. And as you can see, unfortunately, we have died for some reason, but that's okay. We can always bypass the death border at the top and placing a block right there. Okay, so now we can see that it has surpassed almost 80 blocks. That's still pretty bad, but we can keep going. What I want to do now is to replace the pad with force blocks that we have been given. So now let's try setting it to some random value like 100. Point it upwards, and there it goes. Okay, apparently this is going to take too long, so what I'm going to do is place a time warp trigger. There we go, we've now placed a time warp trigger that doubles the speed. As you can see, the jump has surpassed about 445 blocks, but we can keep going. Now let's say we double the value of the force on the force block. And apparently I can't do that, it just surpasses the ceiling. Make it three-fourths of its original force. And I still keep dying. Oh. 110. Let's see. Oh, we can still keep going, I think, beyond 110. 115. There it goes, and yeah, I die. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what force exactly. This is 113 now. How far from the ceiling was it? Oh, not that far actually. 114 maybe? <gasps> yes, okay. We actually survived that. Alright, so as you can see, it surpassed around 553 blocks, which is actually pretty good. But of course, I'm going to push further because, as you can see, we were only in one time speed. Okay, I did not actually anticipate that. Alright, so as you can see from the indication, it has surpassed around 1,023 to 
point to 1024 blocks. Am I going to push further than this? Probably not, because if I input a value that's bigger than 114, I'm probably just gonna die to the ceiling. So yeah, 